This is the counseling schedule of Manipal. Uh, so second round is already completed and the allotment is out on 15th July. So I think it came on 16th July, I guess. So they kept that 15th July after 8 p.m. But uh, it, I think it, it has come on uh, 16th July. Whatever. So allotment is all, already out now. So I'll be leaving the official uh, dashboard link in the description. You can just open that link and uh, check your allotment. If you got allotment, your choice filling option will be turning into green. So whatever option is turned into green, that option is got allotted to you. So third round process is going to start from 23rd July. So it's going to be 23rd, 24th, 25th. What you can do is whoever registered already but didn't got any seat can participate and whoever got the seat they can just modify the options here and and whoever uh, didn't even participate in round one and round two they can directly register for round three directly uh, freshly and they can also fill the choices i mean now i'll be showing you the cutoffs of round two so that you will understand whether you are going to get any seat in the round three or not so wherever there is a star mark that means cutoff remain the same as vacancies due to withdrawals and non-acceptance of round one allotted seat got filled by upgradations and uh, fresh registrations wherever there is a star mark there is no change in the cutoffs okay please keep that in the mind wherever there is a star mark there is no change in the cutoff for example btech biotechnology mit manipal so highest rank uh, student who got seat in manipal is 14079 that is the thing so after that he, no, no one got and when it comes to btech civil previously it was some some different rank but now the highest rank student who got btech civil at manipal campus is 35630 because there is no star mark so it is changed so from round one to round two it got improved i mean for example round one maybe let's say it is somewhere around 28,000 or 33,000 now it is 35,630 so that is what so wherever there is star mark there is no change in the cutoffs so now you have to do your approximations according to this so i expect that in round three or round four there can be major changes because uh, students should pay the second installment before 25th july so few will pay and few will not pay so anyhow they will get the refund of course that is the next thing other thing so uh, what i'm saying is what my expectations are you can see major changes in round three or round four that's what i am expecting okay so these are about the cutoffs please take the screenshot and uh, you, if you see first installment is 1,65,000 that should be paid before 21st July and uh, second installment should be paid before 25th July so like kindly avoid fee payment on the last day to avoid any inconvenience so on completion of course fee the candidates become provisionally admission and failure to make first payment within the stipulated time leads to instantaneous forfeiture of seat and deposit of 10,000 and out of the counseling process. So the next thing is next round will be registered candidates can modify their choices without any additional fee payment. So unregistered candidates can register paying 10,000 rupees and fill their choices during 23rd to 25th July. So that's what I already said. That's it guys. That's it for this video. If you find this as a time worthy video, please do like, share and subscribe. But before that, if you have any doubts and wanted to clarify me through talking to me, just download the call me for app. So I'll be, I have explained already the process of doing all those stuff in a video. So please watch that video and call me there and I'll be talking with you and clear all your doubts regarding anything. Okay. I mean, entrance exams. So tell us then guys, uh, my app link is also in the description entrance corner app. You can also download it uh, using the link in the description and uh, chalo, bye guys.